fun, so this is really cool for me. Um, but throughout the weekend, we experienced various workshops um, on stereotypes in Canada. And I know for me, that was my first time really um, delving into that. And it was emotional, but very transformative. So this, we completed our tiles at the end of our retreat, um, which is over May Long. And after we got over the, oh, I don't know what to draw, or I actually can't draw, um, we took our experiences and made a mosaic that reflected our personal identity as a Canadian. And uh, I'll pass it over to Manira, but. Yeah, so uh, my name is Manira, and I work at the Retreat at Elsie. And um, I feel like the discrimination here in Canada comes out during that is the history side. So the Retreat was really a way for us to really tackle the issues of racism. And I, as a young black woman, had to deal with um, kind of like forgive and forget and really deal with my resentment. And I want to thank Jamie and Carrie, who are my grand friends and close for really helping me deal with my resentment. And um, this here is one of the tiles I drew. I'm not much of a drawer, but it's really um, to pay homage to First Nations people. And this is a feather that I know feathers are really important for them. And this is the red um, background that represents the blood that shed um, in the dark history, in the dark parts of Canada. And this is the tree. And um, the roots of the tree is white, but the, the leaves were black. So if we make it up there like um, Canada's constitution is and foundation is perfect, why is everything um, and the outcome so Damn it, so, yeah. So, we'd like to offer you this. <laughs> As you can see, the map of Alberta. It's very heavy, girls. Well, but maybe it's like the dark one at the top. <laughs> Help you send your weight lifting. It's very heavy. <laughs> <laughs> and this was done in partnership with a local artist called Ann Patrick Smith. Yeah, <laughs> Look at that. How's that? Thank you.